back, chair recognizes Mr. McNerney for five minutes. Well, thank the chairman. Um, <clears throat> uh, this is a, a really important subject to me personally, and I, I'm really glad you held it. Thank the witnesses. Uh, Ranking member Lana and I co-chair the Congressional Wi-Fi Caucus, and I've long advocated expanding unlicensed spectrum on our national spectrum strategy. But Mr. Geis, how do we ensure that the unlicensed spectrum is not That's overlooked as the commercial interests That's push right. for more spectrum availability? Thank you, Mr. McNerney, for the question. Uh, the main way to do it is to recognize that the successful way to effectuate our spectrum policy is to make uh, a variety of access regimes available as we look at spectrum bands. Uh, as has been noted here, you know, the seven gigahertz band, that is, a, that is a great opportunity to expand on our unlicensed work. And so opening that band up, particularly the lower 125 megahertz, could present real opportunities to advance not only Wi-Fi 6, but help us evolve into Wi-Fi 7. But really keeping that mix of access regime, regimes available is what will be critical. 